hemodialysis is a process of purifying the blood of a person whose kidneys are not working normally. Hemodialysis is a procedure where a dialysis machine and a special filter called dialyzer or artificial kidney are used to clean the blood. Usually, hemodialysis treatment lasts about 4 hours and is done 2 to 3 times per week. In this time of crisis, hemodialysis staff wears complete PPE to observe infection control before rendering patient care. Hemodialysis patients must wear face shields and mask before entering the area. The nurse checks the body temperature of the patient, then wears the gown given by the nurse. The nurse assists patient in taking the pre-HD weight to serve as baseline for setting the UF parameters. The nurse secures consent from the patient prior to the procedure. Initial assessment being done to check patient's vital signs. The nurse or technician prepares the hemodialysis machine. While preparing the machine, the hemodialysis nurse assess and prepare the access site, then cannulates aseptically. To start with the hemodialysis treatment procedure, the nurse connects bloodlines from artificial kidney through hemodialysis machine aseptically to patient. During the procedure, Continuous vital signs taking is being done every 30 minutes or as needed to assess and evaluate patient from hemodialysis treatment complications such as hypertension, dizziness, or fainting. Arterial, venous, and transmembrane pressures are also checked and documented to assess the efficiency and effectiveness of blood clearance. Once strict maturation is completed, the nurse returns the blood to patient, disconnect blood lines, then decannulate the AVF needle. Enough pressure is provided to prevent bleeding, then cover with sterile and intact dressing. Post-HD vital signs and weight are taken and documented to evaluate efficiency and effectiveness of the treatment, remind the patient on his next schedule of hemodialysis treatment.